I'm starting out with freshly washed and deep conditioned hair. I've already used my Taylor Beauty coconut cream shampoo and coconut cream conditioner. So now I'm just prepping her hair for the blow dry process. I'm using my Taylor Beauty Grow Thick Oil and I'm going ahead and I'm saturating her wet hair with the oil. Um, this is going to give her shine and this is going to protect her hair through the blow dry process. So I'm just going in and blow drying. I haven't added any additional products um, because I want to keep her hair very lightweight for this hairstyle. Um, and I am blow drying her hair on medium heat. And I'm adding a little bit of my Taylor Beauty Everything Butter um, just to give, give it a little bit of softness and a little bit of shine. So I know you guys are going to wonder how I feel about this blow dryer. Um, I wasn't a huge fan of it on her wet hair, but I think it'll work perfectly on air dry hair. So now I'm just using my Taylor Beauty Jamaica Black Castor Oil Edge Control. And I'm going to put that along her parting for her braid um, because I'm going to put a cornrow and I don't want to have any hair in her face. So anytime I do a corn roll, I do use the edge control around the base of the corn roll. This really helps me um, to keep it neater longer. So I'm just going in and doing a corn roll. And um, another thing, when I do corn roll her hair, um, lately I have um, been blow drying it only because her hair has gotten so long. Um, it's a lot for me to corn roll her hair if it's not straight enough. So um, that's one of the reasons why I haven't really been doing a lot of braiding videos lately. Um, but as you guys can see, um, I am doing just a long corn roll. And this is just going to serve as a faux headband for this hairstyle. So now it's time for me to do her curls and I'm adding the Taylor Beauty Moisturizing Mist onto my hand as opposed to directly on her hair because I don't want the hair to frizz up. So I'm going to go ahead and add that onto her hair um, and I'm also going to mix the Taylor Beauty Everything Butter and the Perfect Coils together. This is going to give the hold of the curls and it's going to give it a nice shine and it's going to give her curls a nice bounce. So for this style, I am using two different color flexi rods. I'm using the gray flexi rods and I'm using the orange flexi rods, the same ones that she's playing with. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and start from the bottom and twist it all the way up in the form of a Shirley Temple curl. And then I'm going to twist it at each end to secure it in place. So I'm going to go ahead and do that in medium sections throughout her hair. Um, I'm not doing anything too small because I do want the curls to be big. I don't want them to be tight. Um, the more hair you have in the flexi rod, the looser the curl is going to be. So I'm just going ahead and I'm continuing to add those same three combination of products, the mist, the perfect coils, and the um, everything butter onto her hair. And I'm immediately adding the flexi rod because I don't want it to um, frizz or shrink um, by the time I'm finished. Um, so you want to add those products really quickly because they are water-based products and they will frizz up the hair. So I'm just going to continue this process until I'm completely done curling each section. So I let her sleep in the flexi rod. She didn't have any complaints about it. You can also let this set for about four hours. So now it is the next day and we are ready to get this party started. <laughs> So here I am just taking out the flexi rod. She actually had pictures for school this day, which is why we did this hairstyle for her Christmas photos. Um, so as you can see, the curls have a ton of shine. Um, her hair is still nice and straight and it has a lot of 
bounce. Um, later you'll see me um, pull the curl and it'll bounce right back in place. So now I'm just going ahead and I'm going to divide the curls into either two or three sections depending on the size of the curl. And I'm just taking it and I'm curling it back into the direction of the curl. I did leave her curls a little bit bigger because I didn't want to cause any frizz and since she was taking pictures later in the day, I did want it to keep it as neat as possible. So as you can see, her hair has a lot of shine and it has a lot of hold, but it also does have a lot of bounce. And I definitely attribute this to the Perfect Coils Curling Jelly. Um, this is a great jelly to hold hairstyles as well as add definition to your twist outs or braid outs. Um, I really did love the way this product made her curls come out. So as you can see, I'm just being really, really careful not to over manipulate the curls so that they can stay in place. This hairstyle did last me for five days. I did put a bonnet on at night and I took it off in the morning and this hairstyle held up really, really well. To jazz up this hairstyle, I'm adding a bow from Cherry Tree Boutique. I'll leave the link to everything mentioned in this video below and I am going to touch up her edges with the Taylor Beauty Jamaican Black Castor Oil Edge Control. This is just going to give everything a nice sleek finished look. So here is the completed look. She really loves it. So if you guys have any questions, leave them down below. And thank you for watching. And also, I did want to tell you guys that for the month of December, I am selling my products for a special pricing along with free shipping. So I'll leave the link to that below as well. And I hope you guys have a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year.